Hey guys, so I'm finally gonna drive again today after probably, you know, three days of a uh, trauma or I'd say just embarrassment. I've been hating myself for like the past three days and this is why. This is what happened. So, I just got back right from buying groceries and going shopping and as I come along right here on the left side, I come along, go, 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 go. I scan the area. I usually I park over there on the on the curb, but then my dad's van was over there. And what I just did suddenly was turn onto the driveway right here. But usually I I just instinctively just go over there, park over there because that's usually my spot to to park. So I just made like a split second uh decision to turn right here. And then park right here, just just park right here. But what I um, please don't call that number. I swear, <laughs> uh, don't call it. It's my dad's uh, work number, and I can't avoid. Well, I could avoid uh, blocking it right now, but just be nice and don't call it. Be courteous. Um, so yeah, I I I, I roll over. Uh, I drive over here into the driveway and try to park right here, right? But then usually, I don't know what happened, dude. I, I think I, I think I know what happened. Uh, well, instead, I run in to the garage door, and you can see the damage. This was actually kind of fixed. It, I'll show you on the inside. This was actually, you know, falling over, and my car was inside, inside the the garage, and yeah, it was terrible. Here it is, like it's being connected with cables, being held with cables, and it was on the ground. Everything was messy, like everything was messy, and glass was everywhere. And you can see the damage right here. I ran into that too. I think I don't know something. This was right here. Was this was over here? So I think this thing ran into that thing, like like that, like bam, like that. So the car just made it that much worse. The impact made it worse, uh, bigger impact. Uh, but yeah, um, I think the reason why I didn't stop and ran into the garage door was that my my foot wasn't on the brake. I guess, I think, I don't know what happened. I, I made a split, split second turn right there, which I usually don't do and it's just, I, I was just so confused because I usually park over there and I didn't park over there that, that time. It was just like, my, I, I got super confused and I guess usually I don't, I don't suddenly break over there. When I park over there, I just let it slide onto the curb and then I break. And I guess right here, that's what I, I instinctively did on the garage door. I'm not trying to justify that I was in the right. I was in the wrong. I I I was stupid. Um, so I I guess I just ran in. I, I pressed on the gas instinctively, and then you know, you know that thing happened. Just okay. Remember it. That was worse. It was a lot worse. I can't stress that enough. It was worse. Glass everywhere. It was messy. I was full of embarrassment, and it just sucks so much. It sucks. I even offered my dad to punch me and he wouldn't punch me and I, I gave my mom money too like my, my birthday money like which was about five hundred dollars and she gave it back it just made me so mad at myself sad at myself pity myself and I even punched myself that wasn't enough that wasn't enough so yeah, that's been that's what's been happening these couple of day, yeah, couple of days, and uh, just terrible. It's just terrible. My first accident, car accident, and just full of embarrassment. And here's the windshield right here. This was actually, uh, you know, that the left side was cracked because that's where I, I, um, I, you know, I sat. In, or I'm not sure why it, that, that was the only place that it cracked in but you know it's fixed now but 
Embarrassing story, right? Really sucks. And the battery's about to die, so. Don't do anything reckless. Don't follow your instincts. Just try to drive really carefully, alright? <laughs> okay, bye.